Chicago Fire Department has a new weapon in its arsenal to battle fires. It is also paying tribute to a fallen firefighter. ABC 7's Jason Knowles joins us live from Navy Pier with a look. Jason? Well, good morning, Linda. The Chicago Fire Department's new boat just arrived here at Navy Pier a few hours ago, and despite this cold, raw, and rainy weather, it got here without any problems. And as you're about to see, it holds a special meeting to firefighters. Coming in from Canada with sirens sounding, the fireboat battled the wind and the rain as it approached Navy Pier. The Christopher Wheatley was named in honor of the 31-year-old firefighter who fell and died over the summer as he was carrying equipment up a fire escape during a restaurant fire. Coincidentally, the 90-foot-long Christopher Wheatley vessel was constructed in Wheatley, Ontario. You can see it has four large nozzles that reportedly shoot out 14,000 gallons of water per minute for ceremonies and to fight fires near the water. It's also made to break up thick ice so it can be used year-round and can be utilized for rescues by scuba divers. Fire department officials did not want to talk about the boat or its arrival today. They say they won't until it's christened in the near future. According to reports, the fireboat cost about eight and a half million dollars. Fire officials do say that this is the first new fireboat that they have gotten in more than 60 years. We're live at Navy Pier. Jason Knowles, ABC 7 News. Sylvia, back to you. Okay, thank you, Jason.